Well, good morning. Welcome back to the channel. Kicking off with a chair. Chair one of the day. We did uh, get a couple of tidbits last night. We got this keyboard, which I have to look up. It's actually really quite heavy, but a lot of it is aluminum. Um, but it's, I just don't know what we want to do with it. I might break this down in the yard so you guys can uh, see what's inside of it. It's a Korg 3M88. I gotta look that up. Let's see what we can find today, guys. Onward. Got ourselves a couple of TV sets. You'll notice that keyboard's no longer in the back. I done looked it up. These things are expensive. So that keyboard, if it actually works, is uh, has sold comps on eBay for like sixteen hundred dollars. And even if it doesn't work, there's some people that are selling them for parts as is for as much as a thousand. So I'm gonna give it a I'm gonna give it a better look before I just start tearing it apart. So we're going to. Uh, See if we can figure out if it powers up or what it does or doesn't do and then make a uh, educated decision from there so uh we've put it in the back of the truck so it doesn't get all jacked up but uh let's uh get on and uh see if we can find some more goodies ah oh, no we gotta look There's a table saw oh you empty boxes table saw empty box dang we might have a bunch of empty boxes here. That's exactly what we've got. Yeah, I got another TV. This one's uh, the possible tester. We'll test this one at the yard. She's already cracked up, so I mean, she'll probably work. Let's get a lot of dry out first. Electronics and water aren't the best combination. Looky, looky Americanos. I'll bet you that's brass all day long. Your wood, you beat up. Hey, what's up guys? I think we'll take this mirror. Those are pineapples. Oh, that is like worth billions for sure. We did clean out a little bit, not all of it. We're still uh, not 100%, but this is gonna be a brass lamp. It's uh, mid-century mid modern with pineapples on it. And it's worth at least a million dollars, maybe more. So we're gonna do a quick test on this and then this is gonna go into the truck. Because watch, you ready? <laughs> watch me be wrong. <laughs> uh, boom, 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 boom. And this is uh, a Hinkley lamp. Pineapple Hinkley lamp. Go ahead, look that one up, guys. Worth trillions. Maybe more. I don't know. Something tells me this is worth way more than way more than the brass so she's gonna go there for now Hinkley look her up just a chance at a battery but we're going for it and I've got a little drill thanks to uh, Alan oh I think someone's already got it <laughs> did you guys saw watch Kev get that dang you Kevin I bet you it was him no drill needed Let's go. Yep, chair two. I did look at the chandelier. Man, it's worth some dollars. We got some nice dollar stuff in here if we can actually sell it. The chandelier, brand new, goes for about $2,300, $2,400. I just don't know if it works, so we're gonna have to plug it in and see if it works. It looks like there's some slight damage to the middle pineapple. That could just be a screw, that could be detrimental to the sale of it but we'll have to uh take a closer look once we get home but it could be nice worst case scenario it's a nice chunk of brass i pulled up a little far on this one intentionally so we could 
knock a tooth out of this. I didn't see this on the way down. I came down that that side. This one just blended in well too, way too good. We'll take this. This is an inexpensive, uh, although she might be aluminum. This is an inexpensive bathroom light or something. Let's see. Nope, she's steel. So that's just that. But we did see this, and this is what we, this is what we pulled over for. Bed frames. <clears throat> Come on. Come on, guys. We're going to go on one trip here. Yes. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on down the road. One, two, three. Hey -ya! Thought it was going to be a bust. We got one this one thing here, maybe two. Little gas blower. Nope. That gonna be it. I think. Maybe not. Maybe. Maybe. Ooh, shiny disco balls. Hello autumn. Nope, 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 and nope. We'll take this though. Onward. Not much. I don't know what this little ramp thing is. I guess it's for working on your car, you pull it up, but I came for the tennis racket. I've got something like that at home. I've got the, the two ramps for each wheel so you can get it up, but that racket's aluminum, worst case scenario. I know. Not much, but we're taking it. Shwink, shwink, shwink. I hope this is not how we're gonna run today. We're just gonna get little tiny shreds like this every couple of spots. Are you metals? Oh, you are metals. Chair three. Shoot. We might get our five chairs. Not much, but looky, looky. Got ourselves a fan. You know it, guys. We're fans of fans here at Nacho Stuff. So take that moment to smash that like button. Because that's what we do when we find fans. Hashtag fan of a fan. Man, these things are busted up. Yeah, that's going to be it. A couple more bits here. Got any tools in you? Nope. Got ourselves a TV. Xmas glass. Oosh. Come on, how do you open? Thing of our. 
his, uh, what is it? His shepherd's hook. Put you in there so you don't get lost. This was what? Two, four, six, seven. Yeah, it's seven. The seven is the, is the expensive one. The seven is the one that is worth, uh, $2,400. And that's just, uh, Shunk. Nada, nada, nada. Ooh, one more. Use metal. Oh, you got stuff in here. What do you got in you? Uh, come on, take a look for that before we toss you. You can come. That's a great little stop. Let's go. Hmm. I wonder if Kev didn't come through here today. I think he would have taken this. Although it is kind of awkward. This is a neighborhood he normally beats me to in the mornings. I don't know whether he didn't run it. Or whether he just said, that's super awkward. We'll leave that for Matt. <laughs> We'll take it. We'll take it. One more and we're out of here. Joink! You come back over here with your other brothers. Come on up here. Shunk. You too. Alright. Joink! Onward. Yep, I'm gonna guess Kev has not been through here. Morning, how are you today? Whoosh. These were my open up. I don't have the batteries for these, but certainly I'd love to get the battery and check that one out though. Definitely not hooking that one. The only bad thing about those is um, the pawn shops won't buy them if you don't have the batteries in the charger. If they're just loose like that, which makes not a lot of sense. But they say no one's going to buy it without the battery. Well, if you give them a good deal, they might. Let's see if this is something before we turn ourselves off. It's going to be. Maybe even a poo pump. Definitely a vacuum. Let's sleep. Oh, it's not. It's an AC uh, fan. That's a big AC fan. Maybe not. I don't know. It doesn't look like an AC fan. I don't know. It's a cross between a pool pump and an AC fan. And one of our favorite things that they we can never figure out how the handles come off of. Maybe we'll just use an axe today. What do you say? Kev definitely didn't run this. <laughs> you wouldn't have left this. That's for sure. So he must have a commercial account today, I'm guessing. Because he's normally out here. He normally gets this thing first thing in the morning. Bravos. Might be salvageable. Away we go. Back on with the bits. <laughs> Come on, guys.
lot of broken New Year's resolutions already. This is the second bike of the day. <laughs> yeah, this workout stuff's for the birds. Alrighty guys, we move things around a little bit. Because we got ourselves in another machine. How do you like that? See, this is why I need a six foot wide trailer. Because this one doesn't quite want to push all the way in. I don't know that I can go too wide. We'll have to see. Ah, oh, sweet, we even get the plug with this one. Scores. This is an old school dryer. Just basic, it's like more dry, less dry. Easy care. Start and off. This is the kind of washer or dryer you want. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Let's see if you can squid there. Come on, go too wide. No. Go too wide like this though, right? Homeward. I know this is gonna be a big old fat TV. It's a metal back. I wish the plug was there. I need a plug. I need that same plug for my uh, for that keyboard. It takes this old this old one. I hope I can find one. I don't know that I've got one at the house. It's gonna be kind of hard to test that keyboard out if I can't find the right plug. Onward. Alright, we got some more stuffs. Bad news is I think I see the garbage bin up there. That's not great. That's not great. Ooh, there were some Olympic weights in there. They must have just got them. This is the box. Oh, this is the post to this lamp. Like, what does this go to? It goes to the lamps, Matt. Pretty fun lamp though, huh? There you go. Onward. Unfortunately, I did see the garbage man. Ah, so they have run everything from the back up here to where I'm at. So I've got to go back and hit the couple of streets that I skipped because of of the way that they merge together with the other streets. But uh, we might be hosed. That might be just about it, hopefully not. Hopefully we can scrounge something up in these last couple of streets. Well, let's get after it. A little something something. I don't know, we'll take it. This, we were just finding little bits here and there, so my guess is we'll probably find just little bits on the way in too. And, Tis what it is. Yep, a couple more bits. Oh, another chair. Oh, by the way, we did find chair four. I had to change batteries. I just this is gonna be chair five. Chair four was this little red chair. I didn't realize my camera was dead, and I went to click it on. It was just that chair, so I wasn't going to uh, goof around with the battery for a chair. Let's see, we got any more of this bench here? These two. Oh, it's a saw, saw rails. Nope, you're plastic. This bike is metal though. Thing in this box out here. Yonder, you can come up top. Onward. Not sure what the gig is here. That's a nice golf bag. Wow, 
poor edge. Yeah, you were coming for sure, dude. Wow, this thing's almost brand new. That is a nice, nice bag. That bag right there, that makes my day. Look at that thing. Hot bunch. You're not even gonna fit in there. You're too fat. That's probably why they got rid of you. It's not a non-cart kind of bag, but man, that's a nice bag. And in case you guys didn't like that one chair that we didn't have on film, these ones will make it up. We've got ourselves a couple. We got a shower chair, we got a pooper chair. This is aluminum, this is not. We should have been up here earlier, huh? Oh gosh, there's water coming out of that gross. We got shower water on me. Hopefully I didn't get you guys and have the camera all messy. Possible though. Sorry. You didn't get it as bad as me though, I can tell you that. Nasty old shower water. Alrighty guys, like I say, ABA, always be asking. Dishwashers are the wash machines up there. Because we're getting ourselves a big old fat AC. Look at the size of this guy. Stopped by and, they, and I said, hey, to you guys, $10. Are you guys selling this? I better not take it in case they're selling it. Because I'm not paying $10 for it. <laughs> but we did get this AC, which is amazing. So I stopped and I said, yeah, we normally take them, but you want it? I'm like, yeah. He said, you can have it. How awesome is that? So uh, that's going to make our day. Let's uh, finish these last couple of streets and get to the yard. We're probably going to have to wait till lunch is over, but... This what it is. Onward. This was kind of just across the street. I thought it was a I thought it was a couple of five gallon barrels. <laughs> it's a I think it's a central vacuum. Right? Uh central cyclone cleaning system. Yeah, it's a vacuum. This is a vacuum cleaner, guys. <laughs> a vacuum cleaner. You fit in there? Oh gosh, come on. Squeeze in there. You can do it. Yes. Maximizing our space. Man, all the good stuff is up in this front neighborhood. I don't know why I wasn't running this one. Oh, it's got mirrors on it. Uh, let's see if we can detach those mirrors. I wouldn't mind the doors, but I don't want to take the glass. It's just asking for trouble, isn't it? You come off. You'll come off or use it loose too. Let's see. Are you loose? Come on. That one's not loose. This one. Well, I guess that's not horrible. It's not a boatload of glass. We've taken more than that before, anyways, haven't we? Problem is. Mirrors are not, uh, they're not, what's it called? Um, oh, come on, Matt, think of the word. Um, you know what I'm talking about, right? Oh, gosh, why won't my brain work? Um, tempered, that's, 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 that's the word. It's not tempered glass, so if it breaks, it gets really nice and sharp. So it can cut you up. But uh, we're not going to worry about it. What's well, the little blood between friends, right? So uh, we're gonna get this uh, strapped down. And I'm guessing we'll see at the yard, unless there's something awesome still on the street. We'll have to see. Onward. All right, guys, we've made it to the yard. Kev was here, so we got this dryer off for him. He said the wash was gonna be too new for his guy. We started breaking this AC down before we got into the yard. And it took a while to get into the yard today, too, so. We're going to have to finish that up before I leave, but that's our day, man. We do have a tear down. I think that we're going to do mostly tomorrow. Not sure that I'll run tomorrow. We'll have to see. I actually stopped by and checked it out today. It's one that Kev referred to me. 
and uh, it should be a pretty sweet deal. We're gonna take our patio down and they're gonna pay us to take the patio down and they're going to uh, let us take all the aluminum with us. So win-win. Fast, they're getting rid of the cubes around here. Take me with it. We're gonna test that TV set. I'm not going to now. <laughs> I got things to do, and Lou's not available till next week.
Huh? Take it to the compressor. Am I in your way? Yeah, man. <coughs> well, while you're there, just take the compressor off, and then you can throw it wherever you want. <laughs> of what I need. That's weird. Here goes to Jeffrey. Ugh. I wonder if that's the one I need. I forget it's been so long. That might be the one I need. That's about it. We're gonna break these couple of things apart. Yep. See you over Jeffries. Let's do some NFJ. Look at all them sealed units. I'll see if Jeffrey can give this to me. It must be uh, for the picking. Don't scratch my car! Oop, looks like you got some more fire pits coming. Oh, book, 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 book. I know this car is ridiculous. I still got kids to get. Gosh! You adding those to my load? Hey Jeff, I found you a lamp today. A lamp? Yeah, a chandelier. Is it a leg? Is it a pineapple? You can hang this upside down no, of your I'm dining good. room table. I'm good. It's brass. I don't want that. This thing's twenty four hundred dollars. So sell it. I'm gonna list it. I, I you think should I'm... list that in the villages, and I guarantee you that would sell <laughs> so quickly. <laughs> it would. I know. It's especially it's a... like you could put a couple different roofer sponges on there. <laughs> <laughs> I plead the fifth. So we have to buy a new scale. Oh really? Yeah, they. So what do those things cost? What do those things cost? What? What does a scale cost? Seven hundred. Seven hundred dollars? Yeah, That's it. With the indicator, ten thousand pounds. Theirs, they want to charge us thirteen hundred with no indicator. I thought you paid like a grand to get it fixed last time. Yeah. Why don't you buy a new one if they're a thousand? That's what we're gonna do from now on. <laughs> because of, because 
he said you're going to pay for them to drive here yeah. or to drive back to the shop. He right. Pay the drive time to and from. And then he put on the new load cell. It was off by 200 pounds. Uh-huh. So I said, put the old one back. He's like, and he hands the new one to me. He said, it's yours. I'm like, oh, I don't want it. He's like, we can't sell it. It's a used part now. I'm like, really? It was on there for one minute. They got a racket going, don't they? Yeah, man. He didn't like it that I that I looked on Amazon. You know. Well, it's crazy. It's cheaper to buy a new one than it is to have them fix it. Yeah, because they were dying green. And they got a bunch of well, see, they probably buy them for seven hundred dollars. Well, they charge you. I mean, I was talking to yeah, TJ from, there was from, from TJ next door. Yeah, two hundred dollars. From here to there, they gave him a travel charge on that. Yeah. Ridiculous, man. This? That dirty, your motor's zeroed. I don't know. Oh, don't let me get in your way, Lucas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody will buy that. Man? Yeah? Yeah. Does it work? Now you make me feel like I should keep it. I know, but I mean, I've got to, I've got to hang on till till that actually happens. Now it's in the computer. Dirty? Still dirty? Yeah. Still dirty? This thing peed on me again. One million dollars. In Venezuela, with the hyperinflation that they have. I lost five pounds last week. Oh my gosh. I but I that. found them in their fridge over the weekend. What did the per what did the pepperoni say when it walked out of the hospital? Don't know. I'm cured. I'm cured. <laughs> 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 That's good. That's a good one, yeah. My doctor advised me to stop having intimate dinners for for four unless three other people are there. <laughs> I don't get that one. Where do you take someone who has been injured in a peekaboo accident? Peekaboo. Not Pikachu, peekaboo. Peekaboo. Yes, peekaboo. I don't know. The I see you. The I see you. <laughs> oh my god. Jeffy's got the good ones. Is there for subscribers? Yeah. Man, they're killing it today. This is from, these are from Delphine. I think I, I hope that's how she pronounces it. There are two seasons in Canada. This is for all the Canadian viewers. She's one. Winter and poor snowmobile season. A refrigerator. Uh, probably. A river. A river. I think you've done one like that before. All right. Alrighty, guys, we're waiting paid. We're not going to dilly dally day because we got to go get some kids. So let's just dive right into the receipt. Tim, 1,360 pounds. Not a shabby day. Seven cents a pound for 95.20. Sealed unit came out of the AC, 67 pounds, 20 cents a pound for 13.40. Electric motors were the microwave and a fan. 15 pounds, 22 cents a pound for 3.30. Irony heavy was the blower. I ended up pulling the cord, it didn't pull at all, so that's why it was it was stuck. That's why it was out there. Uh, eight pounds, 18 cents a pound for $1.44. And then irony light was our dirty aluminum, which was, I think, just a chair. We had, oh, we had one capacitor too. Uh, 10 pounds, uh, 28 cents a pound for 280 for a grand total of one, I think it's 16, might be 18, 116, 14, we'll call it. Plus, Kev gave me 10 bucks for the dryer that I gave to him, so uh, we made some monies there too. And uh, I consider today a win because we still have that brass lamp, we still have that keyboard that we need to find a little bit more out about. We have that sweet golf bag. 
great day. Great day overall. It was uh, not thick scrap wise, but still an amazing day. So uh, smash that thumbs up if you haven't already. I'd love it. Do it. Oh, and by the way, thank you, thank you, thank you for all the people that do subscribe to me because we did make it to 13K. So thank you so much for that. I greatly appreciate it. Now we got to go to 14 and then 15 because 15 sounds more like a, a good stop point. The thing I like about 13 though is all my kids play 13 for some reason. I don't know why they like the number 13, but they do. So it's a good number for me as well. So uh, anywho, I got to go get some kiddos. So uh, it's not your stuff, but I mean, you can't take someone else's trash and turn it into cash. So until tomorrow, be safe, be happy. If there is a tomorrow, like I said, I, I, I have to figure out what I'm going to do because we're going to break down that shed. I don't know that we're going to run the road, but I think we'll put something out because we're going to do a non-ferrous run regardless. So, uh, anywho, be safe, be happy, and we'll do something tomorrow. See you then.